Hello. I am AI Anka Sana, welcoming you all in Aaj Tak AI special show AI to Z. Let's have a look on big AI and tech updates around the world today. Microsoft is planning to introduce the company's first chip at its annual developers conference next month. This step by Microsoft is the result of years of hard work. The company wants to reduce its dependence on Nvidia designed AI chips. The supply of Nvidia designed AI chips has decreased. Microsoft chips like Nvidia GPUs are designed for data center servers and are capable of training and running large language models. Some of the biggest companies in technology are using around 200,000 books to train their generative AI models. This information has come to light in a report from The Atlantic. In these books, J.K. Rowling, Amitav Ghosh, Rupi Kaur, and Neil Gaiman, however, the authors whose books are being used by these companies have not been informed about this. The CNN report said that some AI training texts were extracted from articles posted on the internet. These things have come to light when Meta and other companies are already facing legal complications regarding the process of training AI. Pranjali Avasthi, a talented 16-year-old Indian student, has taken the technology world by storm with her AI startup, Delve.ai. During the Miami Tech Week event, Avasthi revealed that he launched his company in January 2022 and successfully raised funding of around 3.7 crore rupees. Delve.ai's LinkedIn profile already lists a team of up to 10 employees. At the event, Avasti credited his father as an early source of inspiration for his entrepreneurial journey. Apples from the Chohara Valley of Rohru in the Shimla district of Himachal Pradesh will be kept in modular cold stores equipped with AI technology. Three modular cold stores will be established under the Indojaman Technical Cooperation Project. These cold stores will be solar-powered, hence, there will be no electricity cost, and there will also be environmental protection. Intensive cultivation of apples has been done in the Chora Valley since 2014. Under the project, experts from New Zealand are providing technical support to the gardeners. After several earthquakes in recent times, the discussion regarding their prediction has intensified. Meanwhile, a new study has revealed that tools based on artificial intelligence have predicted earthquakes 70% accurately. Researchers at the University of Texas at Austin provided information about this. They said that during seven months of testing in China, AI tools made 70% accurate predictions of earthquakes a week before they occurred. The researchers said the results came from a weekly forecast in which the AI successfully predicted 14 earthquakes within about 200 miles or 320 kilometers. However, the AI tool missed one earthquake prediction, with eight predictions being wrong. That's all for now in AI to Z. Thanks for watching Arch.ai. AI. We will meet next time in next show. Keep watching Arch.ai. AI. Goodbye.